What exactly do you need to have in order to be legal in Mexico? Should I have just a tourist visa? Should I become a Mexican? I'm gonna tell you in detail what exactly do you have to do in order to be legal in Mexico. Ready? Let's go to the classroom. Vámonos! Welcome to this chapter of the last one of the legal residency. Remember how many conditions of residence do we have? We have the tourist visa, temporary residency, permanent residency, and uh, Mexican naturalization. In Baja California, there's two offices. Which office do you have to do your Mexican naturalization? You have to do it in Relaciones Exteriores, Exterior Relationships. It's like the Secretary of State. Imagine you are in Baja California, then the two places to go where they are located, the Secretaría de Relaciones Exteriores is in Mexicali or in Tijuana. What do you have to present to the Secretaría de Relaciones Exteriores, Secretary of State? The following documents. First of all, your birth certificate with apostille, apostille, and authenticate the document, that the document is real and authentic. To authenticate a document, an official document to be used in another country. So you have your birth certificate with an apostille. You have your valid international passport. Has to be no later than six months before the expiration. International passport, the application, obviously. A non-criminal record letter from the state, the state police department, they will issue you a non-criminal letter record from the state. Then, flujo migratorio. What's a flujo migratorio? Flujo migratorio is the history of your legal residency for the previous five years. Remember that in order to do the, natural, the Mexican naturalization, you have to have at least five years of legal residency. Remember? And then, the flujo migratorio is, so they run your history and it's good it's like a plus if you give that document to the Secretaría de Relaciones Exteriores, to the Office of the Naturalization Paperwork. Why? Because it's gonna be very helpful for them. In that case, that when you submit the whole procedure, they don't have to touch bases with immigration to ask for that piece of paper, a shortcut. And then the last one is the non-criminal record letter, but federal. Now, that letter, you have to go to Mexico City. You have to fly to Mexico City. Doesn't have any cost, but you have to present your legal residency and your card, your permanent or resident card, plus your international passport. You're gonna go in person and they're gonna give you that letter, okay? Why this is at the end? Because this one, it has a limit of validation. Something very, 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 extremely important that I'm gonna tell you. Your birth certificate, your international passport, and your card, I didn't put it here, but okay, card, immigration card. Those three things, they have to match exactly the name, has to be exactly the name. If it is for a woman, you have to bring the marriage certificate that proves that you were that person with your birth certificate, then you were married, and then your passport is like with your married last name. Every single official document that you're gonna take from your country to be used in another country has to have an apostille. Almost all the countries are inside this La Haya Treaty. Some of them like uh, Cuba, China, other countries, but there are very few. They're not on that treaty. So if you cannot apostille that document because you're from those countries, you will have to go to the Mexican consulate on those countries, the Mexican consulate to certify the document and they will certify that document, the Mexican consulate on that country. That's it for the legal residency in Mexico. And let's see in another video very soon. We're gonna talk about health, we're gonna talk about insurance, we're gonna talk about accidents, we're gonna talk 
about the culture in Mexico. We're gonna talk about how to move to Mexico. <laughs> We're gonna talk a lot of things. Okay, bye-bye. See you on the next one.